Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Michaela. if you're new here, and if you're not, welcome back. Um, so today, I'm going to be doing my DIY at home facial slash nighttime skincare routine, but I decided to switch it up a little bit today and do a little bit more ASMR, which I'm kind of interested in doing, so why not do it now? So first, what I'm doing is lighting a candle and just setting the ambiance and getting relaxed and then I'm going to put on my favorite TV show and right now that's Love Island. I'm literally obsessed with it so I'm going to put that on and then I'm going to put a headband on my head so that I don't get any of the product in my hair. First I'll be using the Green Clean Cleansing Balm from Pharmacy. I really like this stuff to melt away the makeup. It literally just melts it all away, even waterproof, and I just really like this to clean my skin. I actually use this to double cleanse my skin, which you'll see later in the video, um, but I really like this to break down the makeup. So I'm just going to take a hot towel and gently wipe away the excess makeup and cleansing balm that's left on my skin. So now I'm going in with the Fresh Soy Fleece Cleanser and I really love this stuff because it cleans my skin and cleans all the makeup off without stripping my skin. and. I just really like it. It's very hydrating and it smells good and it's just very fresh. So now that my face is cleansed, I'm going to go in with my holy grail product. This is the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. It's literally amazing. It just takes off every single last drop of makeup that you have on your skin. It's crazy the amount of makeup that you don't think is there, but it actually is. So. I really love this product. I honestly use this at night and sometimes during the day if I feel my skin is just kind of dirty and gross, but yeah, you can see just how much stuff was left on my skin. So now I'm using a facial steamer that I got off Amazon. This is major key. Um, I It was about 40 bucks and it literally makes you feel like you're in a spa, but more importantly, it opens your pores and allows for extractions and dermaplaning. So I'm going to do that for about 10 minutes and then I'm going to go ahead and dermaplane my face using a eyebrow razor that just gets off the dead skin cells and exfoliates your face and removes peach fuzz and stuff like that. Then I'm going to use the extraction tools that I received with my facial steamer. And I'm just going to gently remove blackheads and zits or any spots that I have very, very gently. Um, you don't want to irritate your skin. Okay, so now I'm going in with the Peter Thomas Roth Pumpkin Enzyme Mask. This stuff is so good for exfoliating your skin. So it has aluminum oxide, which is a physical exfoliant, so that's what... You see me scrubbing my skin. Um, I'm going to do that for about a minute, like the directions say. And then it also has chemical exfoliants in it. So it has AHAs, which will chemically exfoliate your face in a gentle way. So I'm going to leave this on for about seven minutes and then I'm going to take it off. Now I'm using the Sephora Glow Peel Pads. These things are literally life-changing. Um, I love them so much. They change my skin so much, but they're um, glow peel pads with lactic acid in them, so which is an AHA, and that exfoliates your face in a gentle way, and I really love this stuff. And then next, I'm going in with the Paula's Choice 2% BHA liquid exfoliant. This is a BHA, obviously, and it will exfoliate your skin a little bit deeper, so I use this every other day. Um, but I like to incorporate both AHAs and BHAs into my skincare routine. 
So I'm using the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow Serum. This is another exfoliating product. It has both AHAs and BHAs in there, so it's going to exfoliate while it sits on your skin. Then I'm going in with my Holy Grail Serum. This is a vitamin C serum. It's the Sephora Glow Serum. It's literally heaven sent, y'all. It's so good. Um, I can visibly see a difference. This is my second bottle. That's how much I love it. So anyways, I can visibly see a difference. It makes my skin glow and I just love this stuff so much. I actually use this in the morning, but for the purpose of this video, I wanted to show you guys um, me using it at night, but you can use it at night if you want to. Whatever floats your boat. Okay, now I'm going in with the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This stuff is a dream. If you have really dry skin, especially in the winter, if you put this on under your moisturizer at night, you will fall in love, I promise. And then I'm going in with the Sephora Firming Night Cream. This is a thicker cream, so I like to put it on when I have super dry skin and I feel that it helps with that. So I'm going to do that tonight because I am having dry skin lately in the winter. For an eye cream, I'm going in with the Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment with Avocado. This stuff is so amazing. It's very thick, so you only need a little bit, but I'm just going to pat that in around my eyes and up into my eyebrows and around my eyes, and it's just super hydrating, and I noticeably see a difference in the morning. Now I'm going in with the Glow Recipe Watermelon Sleeping Mask. This stuff smells so good. Oh my gosh. It smells like watermelon Jolly Ranchers, and it actually does make a difference. It honestly makes my skin so soft when I wake up in the morning, so I like to use this as a moisturizing mask maybe once a week. Next, I'm going to be using the Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask. I really like this stuff because it actually stays on my lips and moisturizes them during the night, but if you'd like a cheaper version, honestly, Aquaphor does the same damn thing. I'm using the Sally Hansen cuticle oil just to soothe my dry hands. Alright, so lastly, I'm going in with the Ordinary Rosehip Oil. I'm just going to be pressing this into my skin. This stuff has helped me so much with my dry skin over the winter. And just don't sleep on an oil, guys. It works so well for dry skin. Alright, and that is my DIY at home facial slash nighttime skincare routine. If y'all like this content for me, make sure to comment down below and like and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video.